All right, my friends. We we are officially in Oklahoma. Good. So, uh, some guy put us up in the hotel, which is pretty awesome. Um, I got my new, I got my secondary clothes out. Uh, I don't feel like uh, riding into prevailing winds with my bibs, my overalls. So I switched them out today, and. We're gonna ride a little bit better, a little lighter, and less uh, stuck with them bibs in the prevailing winds of Oklahoma. Yeah. So, we're gonna be on this road entirely all the way for 53 miles. It's not uh, so much headwinds going this way. And it's not bad. Not bad, I like it. But I do gotta buy me some sodas if I'm gonna make it all the way. It's soda attack. I'm gonna have a soda attack if I don't have one here in a few. I want to welcome you back, guys. Hell yeah. Um, November 4th is my birthday. Um, I'm so happy to be 33. Or it was my birthday, because this is after the fact. Uh, you probably tuned, uh, tuned in to my live stream. Congratulations if you did. Thank you for the donations if you donated. Hell yeah. Uh, we're going to casually roll. We're going to probably be there around 2 to 3 if the prevailing winds... Uh, don't do their job. We're hoping. We're hoping for a good smooth ride. Uh, so this road is slanted. It goes south and directly west-ish. It's like that way, basically. So we'll have a bit of a rough seas and calm at the same time which is probably a little off beat and off tune um let's see let's tune into my mappies um so this road is directly west right now directly which is great, awesome. We're on uh, Highway 66, Route 66. The most famous of them all. Um, my water right there. Yeah, it's on my right side. Um, I wanted to go down to a truck stop but I wasn't too sure of the highway that I wanted was so much rideable because it turns into the interstate sooner or later yeah we can't have that right well <coughs> don't smoke cigarettes kids uh. Uh, oh, I'm dying. I'm dying. No, I'm not dying. It's just a joke. But hey, we'll see you uh, farther down the road. Uh, we're gonna spend a day or 
a couple of days in um in um Tulsa. So or hell I'll tell you what. I already did. Uh, this is pre-recorded anyway, so it's it's technically a day before my birthday, so yeah. Everything I do is pre-recorded. Ha ha. Look at this. Look at this beauty, man. Highway 66. Man, cross winds are heavy. It keeps trying to blow me. That's the only thing that blows me. <laughs> blows me off the road, off the uh, shoulder into the grassy grass. It looks like we got a good little downhill. I've been itching for a downhill to get us above. Uh, hopefully it's about a mile or two downhill because I so desire it. Because we've been averaging anywhere from 5 to 8 miles an hour. Especially in the high winds. Look at all this beauty. This is Oklahoma. North of Tulsa. of a downhill has diminished a hundred percent we got a small decline but it's not as big as I want it we did about a uh, point two miles uphill <sighs> this is a, a dream killer but uh hopefully we reach a town that has like coca-cola because I am jonesing for a cokey right now. So uh, the demonic noise that you heard in the last video, I think it's the wind making it sound like that. Well, we got a bit of a downhill then up. We'll just let the bike do its thing. It does not want me to go any faster. This wind sucks, yo. Ugh. I'm gonna cheat and see if I can get a ride. There's no way in hell I'm gonna make it in Tosa. With this small little, uh, with these heavy winds. small little uh whatever you call these things uh foothills I guess we're in the valley of some sort I don't know but these cows are looking at me all sorts of funniness
Jack, can I help you? Ah, uh, yes, ma'am. My name is Oscar. How are you doing today, Dinge? I'm doing good. All right, that's good, Chenna. Uh, well, my job is to uh, simply go ahead and explain you about the alarm system we have for you. So I can see here you are the homeowner, right? Yes, I am a homeowner. Perfect. And by any chance, ma'am, do you have any alarm system right now, like a home security system? No, my dog just passed away. Oh, I'm really sorry to hear about your dog, ma'am. So, no worries, let me explain you about the alarm system we have for you, what are the new features we are offering, and then you can make a good decision for your house, okay? You're not going to ask what kind of house I have? Uh, what kind of house you're living in right now? A tent. Oh, wow. You said it's wireless, right? You have been kicked from this conference. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That telemarketer didn't like me. Oh, well. Two and a half hours to a little town called Katusa. Katusa! Katusa! Let's go! All right. All right, let's see how well this fucking uh, energy lasts. I don't think that store behind me was a gas station that liked me. I was a little too jittery. I got my second wind. I'm all hypey dipey dup. Woo! Woo! Let's go! Thing that's going against me it's the fucking wind bruh <sighs> I wish I could do 50 miles an hour yo this is some hick town bruh we in some hick town yo uh, so there is a thorn in my tubey tube or in my tire my front one that is so let's see if it makes it uh, i did not to adjust my straps that's why it feels so weird all right all right let's see if i keep this attitude up Wee! Wee! come on attitude Arriba, 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 arriba. So, um, I went from, I don't know, a sourpuss attitude to all the way jittery. Uh, some say that would be manic depress type shit, but I don't have that. So Claremore is 18 miles. 18 miles. We could do it. We can do it. Yo, I got a quick question. You know how it's jaywalking? What if you're on a bike? Would it be called bike walking? I don't know. Cycle walking. I don't know. Write in the comments what you would call that. Because apparently I'm stuck in between of naming that. Okay. We got this. Ain't nothing but a hill. Ain't nothing but a hill. Ain't nothing but a hill. So, uh, this is the town of Claremore, I believe. You can see what a total change of scenery, yo. Like, really. You go from country to this stuff. This stuff. Uh. Yeah. Are we doing this shit on purpose? 
Come on, you young tard. Come on, you young tard. Go already. Oh. Well, go get hit by a car. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Floor it. They got brakes. <laughs> Uh, route 66, yo. Uh, oh, hopefully. Last time I went over, uh, uh, what was it? Beaumont, Texas. I went over the tracks. And my tires got caught. And the slanted uh, tracks like that. I had a race bike at that time. And boy, I tell you. Taking a nasty fall is not anything anyone should take. Whew. Uh. So we got about maybe 17 miles left of uh, riding for the day. Yeah. What a glamorous fucking deal. Uh, I bet it'd be awesome to do Uber Eats in this town. Look at all these restaurants. Um, well, I don't think you can do uh, Uber Eats with Vision Center here. The uh, storage. The storage. Cost plus. Ten bucks. What the fuck is that? I don't know. Uh, uh, get me back to the country, yo. Hello. Oh, look at that. It's, it's the palace. It's our friends. Hey, buddy, get out of the emergency lane, bruh. that's one of my biggest pet peeves is cutting me off. Fucking cars. It's like they have to do it. They have to do it. They see a bicyclist, they wanna cut you off. Like this goddamn motherfucker. He could have parked in one of these spots, but no. He had to be special. I'm gonna ask him. Excuse me, sir. Oh, he didn't hear me. I'm gonna ask him if he's special. Oh, well, it's a parking spot. So, he's approved. You're approved. <laughs> All right, uh, time for me to get back on the curb where I don't belong. This is my uh, emergency lane is right now. Oh well, let's get Lord, there, let's go. Lord, Lord, holy is your name.